The 1047 series features locking, suspended ceiling and closure mounts. These mounts secure wireless access points and DAS remote units with non-detachable or internal antennas. This video demonstrates installation of the 1047 CCOAP 3800 for Cisco Aeronet 3800 series access points. For ease of access point installation and to prevent damage to the door hinge, it is recommended that you remove the door from the back box. To remove, open the door to a 90 degree angle, align the tabs of the door mount to the slots in the back box hinge opening, and slide the door forward. Determine which knockout is to be used to bring in the data cable and remove the knockout. Install the conduit fitting from the inside of the enclosure. Insert the conduit fitting through the hole with the nut installed from the outside of the enclosure. A surface mount box or biscuit jack and equipment cord can be conveniently mounted inside the enclosure. Non-plenum rated cables can be used inside a plenum rated enclosure. Use an adhesive backed surface mount box. Consider the bend radius of data cables and equipment cord when attaching the surface mount box. Remove the ceiling tile and replace it with the enclosure back box. Use a minimum 12 gauge support wire to support the back box independently of the ceiling grid. Attach one end of the wire to the support wire tabs located along the edge of the back box and the other end to a permanent supporting structure within the ceiling, such as a ceiling joist. Run the data cable through the conduit connectors located on the sides of the enclosure back box. Pull the data cable through the conduit connector far enough to allow attachment to the access point. Snap the Firestop grommet onto the cable and slide it into the conduit connector. To install the AP, place the enclosure's door on a flat work surface. Remove the mounting plate from the door by removing the two thumb nuts that attach the mounting plate. Retain the nuts. Attach the AP to the Oberon mounting plate by inserting the feet of the access point into the keyhole slots of the Oberon mounting plate and sliding the AP. The access point should be aligned so that the raised flange of the Oberon mounting plate is opposite the Ethernet port of the access point. The door assembly is finished by attaching the previously completed mounting plate assembly to the enclosure door. Place the slotted holes in the mounting plate over the studs located in the bottom side of the door with the Ethernet ports facing the hinge or with the Ethernet points facing the lock. Once the mounting plate is positioned, secure it in place by installing two thumb nuts. Reattach the door to the back box in the ceiling. Plug the equipment cord into the surface mount box. If a surface mount box was not used, plug the data cable directly into the Cisco access point. Close and lock the access door. The installation is now complete.